Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. We are on a 20 day run, one video every day, Monday through Friday, every week for the week of July. So I hope you're getting something out of it. I got a playlist on my channel. You can go there and see all the videos we've uploaded this month. They're focused on lifestyle, mindset, tips, tips, and tricks, tips, tricks, and techniques that you should know if you consider joining the industry or already in the industry and just getting started. So go take a look at that. Tonight I want to talk about living benefits. We've had these things for a while. I've been around, uh, I don't know, for a number of years, but I still find a lot of agents don't know much about them, even though they're selling life insurance with living benefits, don't know how to explain them, want to know the percentages, what they cover, what they don't cover, all of these things. And look, it's an area where you can go out and be successful, start talking to your warm market, cold market, friends, family, neighbors, start generating some appointments, review some policies, and pick up some sales, protect some families without having to buy a single lead. So on my team, we are on a living benefits mission to change out the old life insurance with the new life insurance. The old kind of life insurance, just to be clear, for those of you who may not know, you have to die in order to get any money. You have to die to collect. The new kind of money is if you die, it's money if you live or money if you die. Right? You follow me? So let me say it again. The new kind is money if you die and money if you live. Look, I've been selling life insurance for over 40 years. Started out when I was 24 years old with a company most of you know called New York Life, then the New England in Pasadena, California. That's why I left Florida to go to California in the first place. I was bitten by the life insurance bug by starting out in a network marketing company called A.L. Williams later called Primerica, but I wanted to go out there and work for a major company and learn the ropes. And what I can tell you, from coming from a captive standpoint, where I worked for a, for a company and had to sell only their product, Living Benefits is a game changer. It was an industry game changer, and I talk about it every single time I discuss life insurance with anyone. Many, even though they have death insurance, do not have life insurance with Living Benefits. So if you're in that same place, and really do not know what living benefits are and what's covered and to what percent, and you're either a life insurance agent or you want to be one, you really got to understand how to have this conversation. It has to kind of roll off your tongue with anybody that you meet when they say, I've already got life insurance. Well, do you have life insurance or do you have death insurance? It throws them every time and allows you as an agent to be that trusted advisor and go over what living benefits really is and the power of living benefits. I find that millennials are more concerned about loss of income, not being able to work, not be able to earn an income, than they are about life insurance. So that's a key point. And again, if you don't really understand as an agent the full potential of everything they do for our clients, even, like I said, many agents that I talk to don't get it, even though they're selling life insurance with living benefits, until they get the policy out, read through it, and find out what it covers and understand why it does matter to your client and how many consumers are clueless and you should be having this conversation with them right now. So let's jump into the subject. You really need to fully grasp the difference between the new and the old life insurance. So our goal should be to go out and protect as many people as we can with living benefits in the event they don't die but cannot work. We have to make sure that everybody we know, everybody we meet, and everybody we come across has living benefits because here is the thing that I know. This is the conversation that you need to have. Okay, number one, people are living longer. People are also, even though they're living longer, are living sicker. Listen to these numbers and take some notes so you can share this with your prospect. One, every year about 735,000 Americans have a heart attack. Two out of those 525,000 are first-time heart attacks. 210,000 happen to people that have already had a heart attack. About half of Americans, about 47% of them, have had at least one of these three factors happen to them. One, high cholesterol. Two, heart disease. Three, high blood pressure or smoking, according to the CDC. Each year, according to strokenih.gov, 795,000 suffer from a stroke. 140 of those, 140,000 of those folks die. 10 to 20 percent of the strokes are fatal. So what happens with the other 80 to 90 percent? Cancer in 2018, it was projected that 
201 people were going to be diagnosed with cancer, and 5,595,000 were going to die from it. 454.8 new cases per 100,000 people each year. So every year, there's 454 people per 100,000 that get diagnosed with cancer, and 171 of those are fatal. I know you're hearing a lot about living benefits out there, but listen, so let me give you a challenge. How many of us can go out there and get our agents and ourselves and commit to telling five people per week about living benefits? And you don't need to be buying leads to, to have this conversation. Here are the facts. As we get older, we're living longer, but we're also living sicker. I, one out of three, one out of three die, but two live and can't work. If that's true, we should be telling that story. That if you live and you cannot work, where does that put you? And listen, I know none of us on here like to sell our friends, family, or neighbors. But what kind of tragedy would it be if someone in your family had the old kind of life insurance, had a stroke, and was financially devastated, lost their home because you did not tell them about living benefits. So here's how I handle this on a call with a war market friend. And I'm going to post this for you in the description as well. It goes something like this. Hey, Jack, you got any life insurance outside your job? And Jack says, yes. Great. What type do you have? Jack says, I don't know. It's a life insurance policy. That's all I know. Is it the new kind or the old kind, Jack? Jack says, I don't know. And I say, well... Is it a life policy or a death policy? Jack says, Steve, I don't know the difference. And I say, well, Jack, is it a life policy or is it a death policy? And Jack says, Steve, I don't know the difference. Well, Jack, let me ask you a question. This is simple. Do you have to die in order to collect off that life insurance policy? And Jack says, well, of course, Steve, it's a life insurance policy. No, Jack, you don't have a life insurance policy. You have a death policy. Jack, you see, the new kind of life insurance is money if you die and money if you live. Here's the issue. Because of modern medicine, Jack, we're living longer, but we're also living sicker. Did you realize only one out of three die of a heart attack or stroke, but two live, but can't work, disabled, and they have a complete loss of income? Let me ask you something, Jack. How's it looking 30 days after a complete loss of income? And you have not died, so you can't claim on that death policy. But you have no income, and you have no means of earning it. They usually say, we would lose our home, or we would have to file bankruptcy, or I don't know what we would do. That's a scary thought. And I go, exactly, Jack. Did you know that 54% of all foreclosures are due to death or disability? Did you know that 62.1% of all bankruptcies were because of medical bills? 643,000 Americans go bankrupt each year due to medical costs. A medical bankruptcy occurred every 30 seconds. That's 1 million bankruptcies in a year, Jack. Look, Jack, you and Jill and I need to get together. I'm going to be in your area Saturday around 3 o'clock. You going to be home? Look, this is way important that we get together as soon as possible. Let me take a look at what you have. And if you have only death insurance, we need to get rid of that or add to what you have to make sure that in the event you don't die, you have this coverage and get you that new kind of life insurance that will cover you. And that's how that conversation goes. It's pretty simple. It's the same conversation if you're working leads for that objection that we all get. Hey, hey, stop, stop, stop. Thank you for calling, but I've already got taken care of. Great. Let me ask you a question. Did you get the old kind or the new kind? I don't know. Well, is it a life insurance policy or is it a death insurance policy? I don't know. Well, it's simple. Do you have to die in order for your wife to collect that money? Yes. Oh, you have a death policy. Let me ask you a question. If you had a stroke, couldn't came home, could not work, you lived, but you could not work, What's your finances look like 30 days after you get home from the hospital? Yes, we need to get together. Look, in closing, how many people can you call this week and have that conversation with them? 10, 20, 30? While you're out doing your daily normal activities, start now. Get out of yellow pad. Even start making a list. Even if you have not got your license yet, make this list. It'll come in handy. Living benefits are a game changer. Many insurance companies do not have term life insurance. With living benefits and you can help them by replacing what they have with the new kind of life insurance next have that conversation next time someone says 
Oh, hey, Steve, I got life insurance. Thank you. Now you know what to say. I hope this was impactful to you. Again, I always hope that I return the value and the time that you invested in me by watching this video. And God willing, I'll see you on the next video. See ya. Hi, my name is Steve, and this is Angela, and we're making a living 100% virtually, anytime, anywhere, while making a difference, living the dream, while we travel the country, and we can help you do the same. Come along with us. We're grateful you're here. Subscribe to the channel and like the videos. Bye. Goodbye.